Hello, Joey John McGuire coming out of Stonoa. I'm sitting in the Harbour View Bar um, in the Crown Inn, which is a hotel uh, that overlooks the Harbour View, hence the Harbour View Bar. It's a wonderfully uh, run hotel, restaurant, pub. Yeah, absolutely fantastic. Staff are brilliant. And the views are to die for highly recommended by Joey John McGuire but that plug isn't my purpose uh, for being on here today as any followers of mine will be more than aware of I'm about to recite my latest poem it's not about me but it's called My Prayer Was Answered and it's more about the young men who died in the First World War written in the early hours of this morning my prayer was answered. Our eyes gave way to fear as, trembling, we advanced through the fog of an early dawn. We were just young boys. Our emotions hidden behind blackened faces, Max fact their camouflage kind on our young skins. Bayonets fixed brainwashed into thinking we were warriors we answered the call albeit with timid steps all of us far too young to die yet destiny said we must and as written most of us did the enemy artillery woke with an angry rage and combined with the mortar fire saw us break into a trot. Amidst the mayhem, I heard the screams of agony for the very first time, and of course I feared death. Fear took my breath away as I charged forward, fueled with blind courage, ready to die. I passed men mangled in barbed wire, wriggling and dying but their chilling screams did not stop my charge. I would die for England, the United Kingdom, Great Britain. No tears would be cried. One of the lucky ones, I returned as an unsung hero, though I must admit, I prayed midst the horror. My first ever prayer, the words I muttered never to be forgotten. I said, please don't take me yet. And here I am. My prayer answered. But the guilt I feel is unbearable when every day I am forced to remember my friends who sadly died. Joey John McGuire coming out of Stornoway in the Harbour View Bar.